Adventure Ness. Welcome back to another day. Um, it's been a few days since my um, since I cut my hair. I didn't get an almost reaction because I was just so excited to see him that I completely forgot to vlog. And once I left the hair salon, I didn't even keep vlogging. So what do you think about my hair? Uh, you guys saw as soon as she said that, my smile went up and it's because I really liked it. So as soon as, I mean, just her with a new cut, I get happy because I know she's gonna be happy. She's gonna be really like feeling herself. I'm feeling myself. So I'm feeling myself. putting on the like other it. shoe. Really good. Yeah, I um, actually he did well, a good job. He did a great job. But you guys know on my way there, I was super nervous. I almost didn't do it, um, but I'm happy I did. So my hair is like shoulder, a little bit like shoulder length, but I feel like it feels so much fuller. And honestly, everything he cut was like dead. But I'm happy. I'm happy that I did it. So, anyway, it's been a few days since then. We are at Home Depot because we are trying to Look buy these guys. Let's see if there's some plants. I do want to put some plants on our porch, just to kind of make it like really cute. We are in so our workout. We go to I think they should have some here. I have some basic ones. They're they're okay. If you go to a nursery, they're just way more. I know, selection. but uh, it just depends what kind of plants you guys are look. You would be looking for, but. Well, we'll I recommend going to nurseries. We're in our workout clothes because we did a workout class this morning with um, our friend Ryan. Mm -hmm. And we're literally like dead. Dead. Yeah. Dead. So, uh, we but did. you know what? In a little bit after we're done, there is a Starbucks next door and we'll pick up a little cereal pick milk. Me up. We'll pick well, up. Well, actually, they don't do the cereal milk. Really oh, they well. don't. I don't we know need why. to find another place. There's right. only been a few times that, that it's, it's been, been on, on, legit point. on point. Yeah. Okay, let's go into Home Depot and see. Honestly, this is probably one of my least favorite stores to come to. I. Me too. I don't. Really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I, I believe you. <laughs> I hate this phone sometimes. I was talking to you guys and I was not even recording for a good solid four minutes. <laughs> anyway wow okay so let me repeat myself wow 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 total fail anyway um i was telling you guys that i wanted to go co get coffee but i remembered that i had this matcha drink that i bought at trader joe's when i did my trader joe's haul and i wanted to try it so i poured it in my glass i have ice in here i tried it it was very very light like it wasn't sweet at all which is fine um but i want a little bit of sweetness so i added some hazelnut and it tastes delicious so just in case you guys are wondering this is from amazon um and i recommend this it's very yummy mm. and if you want it sweet just add a little bit of like creamer so good and i was also letting you guys know that i'm going to crate and barrel to go get some wine glasses i have these wine glasses which you guys always ask me about i'll oh, shoot they're up at the top but it's like my little square ones um i got those at crate yeah i got those at crate and barrel but i want to get like the little redonditos you know like the little ones for like red wine because we don't have any i don't know if the square ones are for um are those considered square or like cylinder i don't know if they're for like a specific wine but i'm assuming it's white wine so i need some red wine ones and i also want to get some plates because the ones that we have are, are the square plastic ones from uh, Target that we bought years ago and they're already like all stained because when you buy, when you like eat something that has like a lot of oil it like st it stains the plastic so it's time for some new ones and so I'm gonna go to uh, Crate and Burrow. I'm not I'm going by myself and one doesn't I think he's gonna do some stuff here so I'm just gonna do a quick run out over there I'm excited about my matcha totally recommend it it is made with almond milk I think if it was made with oat milk it'd be even more delicious because oat milk is so creamy talking about oat milk last night i wanted some um chocolate abuelita and i didn't have regular milk so i'm like you know what let me just make it with oat milk i've never done it it was like it's almost like a hybrid between champurrado and chocolate and i think that's because you know how champurrado is like a little bit creamier and thicker that's kind of what happens with the oat milk. I want to perfect it, and then I'm going to share it with you guys if I discover anything else. Because like, I kind of want to add something else to it. I don't know. But it was delicious. Anyway, let's get going so that we can get back. Because I think we're going to go to my dad's house later. We made it. And I just getting out of the car was a struggle. I am so sore. I don't know if I told you guys, but I thought I was going to throw up. 
at the workout because it was like one of those like high intensity where it's like different stations. Oh my God, I thought I was gonna barf. I thought I was gonna barf from us. Ooh. Oh my God, I'm so excited. I get so distracted easily. Okay, let me show you guys. They have so many Christmas stuff. Like how stinking cute. Oh Jesus, are these. Oh my God, they're so cute. Oh. And look at that little guy. He's cute too. Okay. Um, so this is where they have all their ornaments. So much Christmas stuff. I was not prepared. I was not prepared for all this. I just came through some plates. I need to find the wine glasses. Okay, let me not get distracted. I'm, I'm gonna come look at all this, but I wanna go find the plates first. Um, I think, oh, right at the entrance. Look at this. I actually have these. I bought them last year, I think. Um, but how cute are these? Oh my god, they're so cute. Look at the little snowman. Oh my goodness. Oh no. Okay. Let's get the plates. These are cute. These are the Mercer dinner plates, but they only have the big ones. I don't think they have the small ones. They have these little baby ones. But these are for what? Like dessert, maybe? They have these placemats that are very festive. They're kind of cute. Kind of like them. They're $12.95 each. What do you guys think? Holiday Hounds Tooth Placements. They're cute. This napkin. Oh, these plates are nice. Found them. Okay, so these are the wine glasses I like. How pretty are these? They're still like a little bit modern, but still kind of traditional. So, I'm gonna go with these. I'm gonna do four of those. So the ones that I have, wait, they don't even have them. I don't even see the, oh wait, they're down here. So I have those. Oh, that's kind of cute. Are these supposed to like go with those? Oh my gosh. Oh, oh yeah, see, these are white. Oh wait, those are red wine glasses. Interesting. So I have the taller ones. So the red are for, I mean the taller are for red and then the smaller ones are for white. Do we like these or do we like those? Oh, what do we think? Oh my gosh, I don't know. Okay, there's these. And then there's these. I think I'm gonna go with these. They're just like a little bit more traditional. I am home now, Ovi, and once I left Crate and Barrel, I got a horrible, like, almost like a tension headache, but I think it was because I was dehydrated. So I came home, had some uh, Gatorade. We were supposed to go to my dad's house and spend time with family, but I started getting a headache, and I'm like, you know what, babe, let me just rest it up. I look so cute right now. <laughs> Um, and I slept for like an hour and I woke up and I still felt it. I got in the shower and I feel so much better. I think it was just from like the gym, the sun, because I started feeling the headache once we were at Home Depot and I, it started like the sun was hitting me in the face and I was kind of like frowning and then I started feeling like that headache right here. Uh, so we are in bed and I'm watching, um, I don't know what this is. It's like a Tom Hanks. I don't know if it's a Disney movie. A Tom Hanks movie, but we just ordered pizza. It's not that much better, but we ordered pizza from Guido's. If you guys haven't had Guido's and you're from the valley, I love their pizza, but that's what we're having. And um, I was gonna say I wish I had my red wine, but I'm already dehydrated. I don't I should not be drinking wine. Uh, so we're just gonna have our pizza. Tomorrow I have a long day. I'm going to the hair salon in the morning, and then I want to film all day tomorrow. Like I want to just crank out videos crossing my fingers that that's the way it happens um because sometimes i'll plan out like oh my gosh tomorrow's gonna be my film day and then i end up not filming so i'm hoping tomorrow will work out that way um so yeah i'll just show you guys once our pizza gets here i'm really excited because we normally get um mushroom jalapeno pepperoni and pineapple it's like you get the sweet the salty so good. the spicy
just got here. I wanted to show you guys. Jalapeno, mushroom, pineapple, pepperoni. Side of ranch and buffalo sauce. Because mm, mm, mm. you know, we need some dipping sauces. After working out, this is our <laughs> this is our treat. It is so good. I love this pizza. And we're about to watch a movie. So and then we have this one right here. He's up here. And then the little ones over there. Always. When we eat. Buenos dias. It is the next day, and I just realized that I did not end the vlog after. Um, we had our pizza, we watched a movie, and then we had we both had a headache, so we ended up just going to bed. I think it was that we're, we were super dehydrated from the gym, and like we like over-exhausted our body. I don't know, but I just finished making my cafecito in my little tumbler that McDonald's sent me. Sent me, it says, Arena Chula Mac Cafe. Mama, I made it. <laughs> when I got my first PR package from McDonald's, I was so excited because you guys know I love McDonald's. Ah! I wanted to do a quick unboxing with you guys because I have a ton of stuff on my table. Let me show you. My lipstick is halfway off because I just finished eating in and out And I made myself a cafecito with my cute little mug that I got at Trader Joe's. Not Trader Joe's. <laughs> TJ Maxx. It says never give up. But it was the perfect mug. Um to start my mornings. Let me show you guys the table. You see that? Lots of goodies to show you. So let's get started. I'm gonna show you guys some of the newest things that I've gotten in PR. So the first thing is from Jouet. They sent over a little bottle of Champs. This is, oh, Rosé. A little bottle of Rosé and a new Radiant Translucent Powder. Green tea to soothe, hyaluronic acid to hydrate, and vitamin E to nourish. So it is a Radiant Translucent, so it's going to have a little bit of a glow. Kind of like the one that Laura Mercier launched, um, except that theirs is a loose setting powder, and this one is a pressed. Um, the packaging is super cute and luxe. It comes in this. It does launch uh, December 3rd. And this is what it looks like. I'm excited to use this. And I love the little packaging. Next, we have three sets of brushes from Luxie. I tried Luxie brushes a long time ago, but I haven't tried them in a while. And this is a collab they did with Belle Thieps. There's three little sets here. Super cute. And two other like eye sets, I think. There's so many little holiday sets. Like, look at this little holiday box. This one is from... I believe this is, yeah, Salon Perfect. So they're holiday bundles. These are super cute for somebody that you guys know loves lashes and nails. So this comes with a set of lashes and then also some press-ons. So there's that one and then there's this one, the Gift of Glam. Um, and then there's different lashes. Winged and then more um, press-on nails. And then there's also these little sets of polish. Okay, next, this got me really, really excited. So if you guys have been wanting to try Kate Somerville, um, and you want to splurge this one is a set it is originally retail the value is $250 and it's going to be 160 so it comes with the Foreo so this really cleanses the skin and then there's the Kate Somerville exfoliate cleanser also comes with my favorite um exfoliator so this one is their exfoliate this is such a good product to exfoliate like every time I use it I use it especially like in my t-zone because I feel like that's where I get like blackheads and like my skin feels like dry. Um, it's originally, I wanna say like 60 or $70. So you get that here. It's obviously a little bit smaller, but a little goes a long way. So this will last you a while. And then there's also this little product. Which I'm not sure which, what is, what this is. Um, let me see, does it say here? Oh, here it is. It is their Glow Moisturizer. I've never tried that, so I'm excited to try that. This is their intensive um, exfoliator because it like really, like your skin feels baby soft after this. And then obviously the Foreo uh, Mini 3 and you get all of that for $1.59. So you guys can find this at Sephora. That's a really good deal. And then there's also, we also have a little duo with Living Proof. You guys know I love Living Proof. Love their products. I actually have been using a scalp treatment and I'm going to keep using it let you guys know my thoughts once I've used it for a few months. So this is a Restore Perfecting Spray, dry shampoo. I love it. But there, are, there's, it's like a little duo. So again, I feel like right now for the holidays, it's the perfect time for you guys to try out any products that you guys have been wanting to try because you can get them in like smaller sizes or like more of a value. So then there's the Ren um, Toner. This is their Glow Toner. I believe this is a... No, this is a, a AHA Lotion. So... Um, this is going to exfoliate. Um, so this and the 
dry shampoo is fifty one dollars. This little duo, which is cool, because you get to you get uh, you know you get some skincare and you get some hair care. Um, I also got a bunch of stuff from Truff. So I actually bought this uh, the Truff oil, not oil, um, hot sauce. Where did I get it? I think I got it at Target actually, and they sent me a ton of things. Like a ton of goodies. Um, next, we got the Desi Skin Overnight Mask. And they also sent this super cute eye mask, which is, I mean, sleeping mask, which is so, so cute. More holiday sets. So this one is from Laura Mercier. This one retails for, or it's going to be $39. It has a $55 value. So if you guys have been wanting to try the Laura Mercier setting powder, this is gonna be your chance. It comes with, I believe this is like a limited edition uh, packaging because it has like the little gold packaging the gold cap which is super cute and then it also comes with a little puff Ta -da! so i went to create and barrel let me show you guys what i got i know i was talking to you guys about the wine glasses so i ended up getting the wine glasses they're very very nice very nice look at this i mean they're like as big as my head they're pretty big but i love them i love how they look and I think they were $17 each, so they were a little bit pricier. They had some other ones that were a little less, but I really like these because I feel like they look kind of traditional because they still kind of like that roundedness, but, it, you know, with a little bit of zhuzh to them. So I got those. And then what about these candles for outside? Because um, I'm going to put them on. Um, I'll show them to you guys. They're a little too big, like too round. Um, but it'll still work because it could sit on top. You know, sometimes it has like a little base, but it's just going to sit on top of the base. So those were $17. And then I bought this little garland. How cute is this? So I'm planning on hanging this on my mirror. This one was $20 and it's a six foot garland. I'm going to drape it on my big mirror, like the one where I take pictures and you guys will see it. But that is everything that I have so far for PR. Uh, thank you guys so much.